Which of these activities are controlled by the nervous system? If you guessed all of them, you're correct. Welcome to Moomoo Math and Science and the Nervous System. The nervous system coordinates the activities of your body by sending electrical signals up and down your body using nerve cells called neurons. Here's what a neuron looks like. The nervous system enables your body to respond and adapt to changes inside and out of your body. This system can be separated into two main groups, the central nervous system and the peripheral nervous system. The central nervous system contains your brain and spinal cord, and the peripheral system are the nerves that extend throughout your body. Your spinal cord receives information from your skin, joints, and muscles of your body. It also carries the nerves that control all of your movement. The brain receives information directly from your body and the spinal cord. It uses this information to help you react, remember, think, and plan, and then sends out the appropriate instructions to your body. The main function of the peripheral nervous system is to connect the central nervous system to the limbs and organs, therefore becoming a relay between the brain and the spinal cord and the rest of your body. The peripheral nervous system is divided into the somatic nervous system and the autonomic nervous system. Whether you want to learn how to dance, throw a ball, or go for a run, the somatic nervous system plays a role in controlling the movements of your body. This system controls all voluntary muscles of your body, so when you decide to move a muscle, you are using the somatic part of your peripheral nervous system. The somatic nervous system contains two major types of neurons. Sensory neurons, which carry information from the nerves to the central nervous system, and motor neurons, which carry information from the brain and spinal cord to muscle fibers throughout the body. The autonomic nervous system controls internal body pressures, including many of the following. Blood pressure, heart and breathing rates, body temperature, digestion, and many more. The autonomic nervous system has at least two branches. The sympathetic nervous system, which springs into action during emergencies, and the parasympathetic nervous system that goes to work when the body is at rest. Many times, these two systems will work in opposite directions. Thanks for watching, and remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.